Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a full case break of 2019 Topps Gold Label Baseball. All 16 boxes. This is pick your team number three. And check this out. All cards ship. A lot of different levels and class one, class two, and a lot of fun things to to collect there. So all of this stuff ships. I guess they're all inserts right there. So there it is, the 18th, 2019 Topps Gold Label Baseball. If you see a little rooftop next to your name, that means you got that team in a team random, which is in a separate video, which I th think I forgot to upload. Oh, no, I did upload it. No, I didn't upload it. Hang on, let me do that really quick. And it looks like the Yankees just beat the Astros 4-1. to one. They're extending the series. Now, for those of you watching live, that team random is now posted, so you can just see the randomizer. But there's everyone else. Thank you very much for getting in. Really appreciate it. Thanks for spending a bit of your Friday night with me. All right, so now we're, we're going to game six now. The last two games in Houston. What do you think? Do you think the Yankees take it to seven games? Good luck, everybody. So you see four stacks of four to make 16. Each box has a gold frame autograph. That's the that's the whole that's the whole thing about this one. Could be some pretty good stuff. I like the frames. Good luck, everybody. Logan's back. We were waiting for you, Logan. Now we can start all the rest of our breaks. That's the frame right there. Jack says, I don't care who wins it, but he's a Nats guy, so he hopes it goes the full seven. So all cards ship, which is good news for all of you collectors. That, so there's all the class one, two, and threes, and all the different numbered ones and whatnot. So a fun uh, set building product. And behind Reese Hoskins is a Mariner, Justice Sheffield. Justice being served to DMAC, Darren McKenzie, who got the Mariners straight up. You don't want the series to go too long, though. I, f I feel like there I, I saw I saw some numbers somewhere where um, where if it was like say if, if a team gets too much rest then there's actually there's actually a point of whatever they call it dim a law of diminishing returns right there could be too much rest you know hot bats start to get cold. You know, pitchers are, are getting too much rest now. They're a little, they're a little rusty. Ray, what's oh, Rem? What's going on? There's the seventy-five. Oh, maybe I'll maybe I'll, I guess it doesn't matter, right? Because the World Series is set for Tuesday. 
They're not going to start it any earlier. More numbered cards than this one, serial numbered cards. Charlie Blackman to 50 for the Rockies. So, oh, there's actually three teams we didn't sell because they barely have anything. Diamondbacks, Rockies, and Marlins. Right, so this Rocky I'll randomize. In fact, any other cards... Charlie Blackman will represent uh, Arizona, Colorado, and Miami, by the way. So th they'll be all one lot. There you go. They're moving on to Texas. And we have the Astros. There's Miles Straw. That'll be for Art with the Astros. Got the Astros straight up. Not sure what we're doing next, Logan. I guess everyone wants baseball today. I thought it was going to be a basketball day. But I don't see any other orders coming in aside from Levi's uh, Cup hockey order. Maybe nothing. What do you want to do, Logan? How about you? You drive. You drive the show. Forget about putting it into committee. You lead the way. Follow the leader. But Merrifield, Buster Posey. And your frame behind Trevor Bauer is going to be a pirate. That's Kevin Newman. Newman. That'll be for Art Jackson and the Pirates. Remember when David Ortiz, I'm watching the post-game show. Remember when David Ortiz got shot? That was, that was, a, that was a scary moment there. Steve Olson wants to do some hoops. Yeah, why don't we knock out some more immaculate basketball? We've waited so long for that. Let's get it done. It's finally here. It's real. Today is the day. Well, it's all on jazbeescasebreaks.com. off the Cody Ballinger. Uh, he tosses talk to their foil guy. Okay, foil guy. What's going on here? Javier Baez, and he reveals a Tampa Bay Ray, Bren Lau. Rookie autograph in the gold frame, Jason Moyers with that one. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Uh, 
Next box. So who's pick? Must be Garrett Cole next game, right? For the Astros. Garrett Cole at home. That's gonna be a, that's gonna be a tough game for the Yankees. Piazza Mets edition to 150. Carter Keyboom. Save a few, couple of those the bigger names there. All right. Behind Glaber Torres is a Blue Jay, Sean Reed Foley. The old SRF going to Kenton and the Toronto Blue Jays. There you go, man. Yeah, Matthew. They, 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 that was, they were purchased straight up, at least. Mike Piazza to 99. Tony Gwynn to 25. Maybe a bullpen game for the Astros? No, maybe you got, I think I think you have to roll out Garrett Cole out there. Kill the series game six. There's Sandy Koufax. And there is Kevin Kramer. Now you have Kevin Newman and Kevin Kramer. Kramer and Newman. That'll be for Art. And the Pirates. Gave up some early runs, but he settled down. And then it was the uh, Houston bats that got a little cold. Couldn't generate anything. Mm. 
Carlos Correa to 75. And the frame behind Thor, Noah Syndergaard, is going to be Josh Hader. That goes to Tony and the Brew Crew. That was last spot mojo, looks like. Nice. We were just sitting there. Like that little bit of dust that was stuck in there. There you go. It's a lot cleaner. So we got that judge to 150. Got the Miggy to 50 for Leonard. We'll save an Eloy for the White Sox, Steve Becker, and we'll save a Senzel for the Reds, Corey. All right, let's see. The frame behind you know, an old Mad Max Scherzer. Gonna be another Brewer, Josh Hader. This time, 57. Check that 67 out of 75, numbered this time. Another one for Tony and the Brewers. Last spot mojo. Strikes again. All right, now we are halfway through the break, folks. We got eight frames to go. Alex Bregman to 150 for the Strohs. Out of 50, Noah Syndergaard for the Mets. And a Vlad Guerrero Jr. for the Blue Jays. All card ship in this particular break. All right, and behind Pete Alonzo is going to be Cole Stewart. And that will be for Art and the Twins.
And we got a relic down there. Nice flag row, Junior 99. Beautiful teeth, brilliantly simple. Total gym includes everything you need. Barry Lark into 150, and there's Otani. Alright, Tyler, happy Friday to you too. Alright, there's Tatis Jr., Yusai Kikuchi, and Legends Relic, Ozzy Smith. 33 out of 50. That goes to Karen and the cards. Thanks, Karen. Game used memorabilia there. I if this fits into a 130. Much more secure in a 130. There you go. Nice. All right, and your frame behind the kid, Ken Griffey Jr., is going to be, for the Oakland A's, it's Ramon Laureano, 73 out of 75. Steve. Steve Cody, I think, with the A's. Turned out to be a great signing for the, or a great trade, I think, for the Yankees, right? Was it a trade or a free agent signing? I forget. No, it was a trade, right? Because I think they sent, they sent Justice Sheffield over to, to the Mariners, among others, in return. Deion Sanders, 20 to 99. It's Braves edition. It's for the Braves, that's for Kelly. And the frame, Chris Archer. Or no, Chris Archer's the card in front of the frame. The frame is Daniel Ponce de Leon. For the Cardinals, that's for Karen and the Redbirds. Tyler, what would you say is your favorite product across all sports? That's a good. That's a good question. I would say whatever product I'm about to break next is my favorite. That's my favorite. I don't know, like most people, I think, you know, I, I think I tend to like the higher end stuff just because there's usually so much, you know, unique and interesting things that are generally in there more often than not. But every product, it's hard to say, every product has its own unique thing, which makes it, which makes it different, which is good. You know, you want frames? We can do a bunch of gold label. I like the frames. These are pretty sharp. Edward. Oh, of course, Edward. The uh, the Luka Doncic Trey Young dual autograph that 
Well, Nick pulled that one, but I mean that's got to be at least fifteen thousand dollars, right? And RPA too. For Luca. And there's Glaber Torres to 75. Yeah, check. The luminaries was pretty fun. I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind digging, digging through some more of those boxes again. And we got Cedric Mullins. Uh, that's for Joe Kroll, who got the Orioles in a team random. I actually do kind of like the Ginter. Ginter is pretty funny. A lot of unique stuff in Ginter that I enjoy. Do I have what now, Logan? Luminaries? No, if, we had, if we had luminaries, you, you don't, you don't, don't you think we'd put it, we, we, we would have put it on the site by now? I'm not going to let luminaries just collect us in the back. Francisco Lindor. I heard some trade rumors. He may have it somewhere else. Least favorite product? Um, I like all of them. We wouldn't put a product on the site if we didn't like it. So whatever's not whatever's not on the website is what it, is what we don't like. What we don't buy and what we don't break. Bryce Harper. Behind him is Luis Urias. 31 out of 50 for the Friars. And that goes to Shusaku. Pick up the Padres. You thought, of, you thought of Luminaries fell behind a desk or something? And then we'd have to yell at the inventory control department. Least favorite that I break? I like all of them. I wouldn't break it if, if it wasn't my favorite. They're all my favorite. They're like all like they're all uh all like my children to me. My least favorite break is anything that's over ten minutes. <laughs> I wish I could just break flawless all day long. Yes, gold label specifically just has one gold frame per box, Edward. That's that's the that's the whole deal with this set. And this is pretty unique because it has like a lot of class one, class three numbers and all that sort of stuff. So a lot of people like to. That's why we're uh, shipping all cards in this gold label because people generally like to build. Uh, sets and this sort of stuff if they're into that sort of thing there are still some set builders out there in the world they still exist all right there's the chip off the old block chipper jones and the frame is Fernando Tatis Jr. Nice. And that's another, uh, that's one for Shusaku Hitakawa. There you go, that's nice. I think he got a Fernando Tatis Jr. in a different break. Different product, maybe. There you go, that's nice. 
There's tradition. I don't think there's a case. Well, no, I think there is a case hit for this, Jack. I think it was that relic. That right there. I think these fall one per case. There. There's Beetle right there. You're welcome. What was the other one we got? What, what, was, what product was that other one? It's nice, though. It seems to be the real deal. We met him at the uh, in Arizona earlier this year at the Topps Industry Conference. So big thanks to Topps for hooking Jaspies up and the rest of the people attending the conference with, uh, with Fernando Tatis Jr. Did a little signing there. People got to talk to him. Seems like a really nice kid. I think de definitely like the... Uh, he had the comfort of of being of growing up in like major league baseball locker rooms. You know what I mean? Just had that kind of comfort. There's Giancarlo Stanton to 150. A lot like uh, like Patrick Mahomes when we met him a while ago. He also had a sort of not like not even like a too cool to be school sort of thing, but just a coolness, a comfortableness around him. He was easy to talk to and. Pretty open, into it, having fun. Good dudes. Ronald Acuna Jr. is Trevor Bauer. 27 out of 50 for the Indians. That's going to go to Leonard Yance, who picked up the Tribe straight up. All right, last box, ladies and gentlemen, good luck. Gold frame, ladies and gentlemen. All right, good luck, everybody. This is Pick Your Team 3, Gold Label Baseball. Good luck. Hey, Brad. Nationwide, Amazon, teamed up to bring you the all-new Echo Auto. Good answer. You only make a great fan. Fans are going to love it. 24 out of 75, Ronald Acuna Jr., Braves. And the final frame in gold labels hiding behind Gary Sanchez. And it's going to be the straw man, Daryl Strawberry. For the New York Metropolitan, that's going to be for Greg. <laughs> Greg got, got you at the very, very end. There you go. So thanks for getting in and thanks to everybody. For getting into Picky Team number three, 2019, Topps Gold Label Baseball just came out recently. Thanks for getting into it. We'll see you next time on jazbeescasebreaks.com.